The Essential Side of Speech Exploring the Mystique of Breathiness Vocal Image Podcasts Everything you want to know about the human voice There's something captivating about a breathy voice that can make our knees weak and send shivers down our spine. It's that delicate, wispy sound that floats into our ears and captures our imagination. Whether it's the subtle vulnerability it conveys or the way it draws us in with its intimate whisper, a breathy voice has a certain allure that's hard to resist. A breathy voice is characterized by a whispery or airy quality in the voice. It happens when the vocal cords don't fully close during speech, allowing air to escape and create a softer, less intense sound. To develop a breathy voice, it's essential to relax your throat muscles and use gentle, controlled breaths. Practice speaking in a soft, gentle tone or whispering, gradually increasing the volume and intensity of your voice over time. People are often attracted to a breathy voice because it conveys a sense of intimacy, vulnerability and sensitivity. However, some may find it weak or unassertive depending on the context and personal preferences. Voice therapy can help individuals with breathy voices by improving their breath, support, vocal cord closure and articulation. According to esoteric conception, a breathy voice can indicate a more spiritual or intuitive personality. One of the most famous celebrities known for her breathy voice is Marilyn Monroe. She deliberately practiced speaking with a pencil between her teeth to open up her vocal cords and create a breathier sound. Her whispery tone in her speaking and singing voice added to the sensual quality of her voice. Critics may have claimed her breathy voice was an affectation, but it's undoubtedly a defining characteristic of her persona and contributed to making her an iconic figure in Hollywood history. Whether a breathy voice is considered sexy or weak depends on personal preferences and context. In intimate conversation or love songs, a breathy voice can be very attractive. While in public speaking or job interviews, a more assertive voice may be preferred. Vocal exercises such as humming, lip trills and gentle sighs ah, can help you train a breathy voice. Remember to work with a vocal coach or therapist to ensure you're using proper techniques and avoiding any potential strain or injury to your voice. Breathy voice can be useful in a variety of situations, including singing, acting, voiceover work and public speaking. In singing, it can add a softer, more emotional quality to a song, while in acting or voiceover work it can convey a sense of vulnerability or sensitivity. However, it's important to use a breathy voice in appropriate context and not rely on it exclusively. The Vocal Image app is a helpful tool for training a soft, breathy voice. It provides a range of exercises and feedback to help you improve your voice quality and build your confidence. With practice and patience, anyone can develop a beautiful, breathy voice.